honor for us to present our own idea and uh, to make the contribution to the development of our city and at least to develop our citizens, to make them more happy, to make them wander around and enjoy our great, uh, our great town. So uh, we would like you to present the uh, outdoor explore. Here's the strange uh, name, but we hope it will work. So let's go. Uh, before we uh, before we started developing the, the our application, we faced the three main problems that we would like to to help to solve. The first one is searching and filtering sites, some locations you would like to visit. For example, you are new to the city, you are a foreigner, you are a tourist, and we don't know where to go, so uh, we, would, we, would, we, are, we are trying to find a solution. Also, road planning takes too much time. Sometimes you have no idea where to go, what to do, so it's good when someone is helping you to find the way or find the good road to, to follow in the unknown city. And also, it's inability to correctly estimate the amount of time needed for the tour. For example, you are going to Kilo Pichesco Lava and you have no idea how much time you should spend there. Or you are going to Hishati and as well, you have no idea. Like, this should be 30 minutes, 40 minutes, you have no idea. So, we will try and do this app, answer these questions. Uh, so, what do we open with our app? Explore app automatically aggregates all must-see places of the Kyiv city. Uh, also, we have processed uh, our 6 um, million sets of data about movement speed, which was provided by Uber Movement. Our app could also provide you with optimized roads based on sites you selected, taking into account the average time you should spend there. So, all this stuff, we come up this night, and we would like to present it to you. Of course, who will make the most of it? It was also the main question for us, and we decided that there are three categories. Foreigners who are new to the city, they have no idea what to do, where to go, so this app will, be, will work great for them. Also, it's tourists from other cities of Ukraine. Like most of us, I'm from the west of Ukraine, so when I went to Kiev, um, I had no idea where to go, so it was like my local, um, local area, so and that's it, I have no idea where to go, and all I can do is just Google and, and that's it. And also locals who are like to explore Kyiv but not ready, ready to spend tons of time surfing forums for sites. I have a lot of friends from Kyiv who are not really good at uh, wandering around, see some beautiful places in Kyiv, they're just sitting at home, so for that guys we created this app that could help them be more proactive and see how beautiful Kyiv is. Uh, so, uh, also we would like to, to separate the time before we using the app explore and after we written the explore. So before before we use the normal user, he should spend many hours on TripAdvisor to check for some cool places, where to go, the race and stuff like that. Also, he need to spend minutes swiping on Google Maps to find good places or not so good, to find the road, is it busy or not. Also, he should uh, check travel forms to get uh, real feedback. Also, he need to estimate the correct period of time for visit in order not to come to the busy place where it's crowded and stuff like that. And a lot, a lot of routine work. And with our app, Explore, all you need to do is just go to app, choose sites you would like to visit, get the roads, go and enjoy your time. And before we go to the demo, we would like to share with you also the three main principles we followed during developing the Explore app. Uh, first of them is it's easy and free to use. Also, it saves you a lot of time and it helps you explore the city even if a local or a foreigner. Probably at this point you have some questions, we would like to answer them, and after that we would come to them. 
Okay, so we have to see it in demo. <laughs> okay, just give us a few minutes and we'll get it. But you still have a few minutes, so we can read. <laughs> Take your time. Exactly. So it's not okay to waste your time, but I'm sorry, you know, you try to fix uh, You can show by the formality. All pass sit on the first row, so. Grant me a bit, please. Just close the board. some network issues. Uh, here I have my application, but here I have oh, yeah. my yeah, yeah. private conversation. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, it's so good, so you don't know Ukrainian language, so uh, I'm not so shy. Um, here you can take a look on our beautiful landing page, and uh, while you're excited, I just uh, want to say is that uh, it was really great. Uh, it uh, was a good challenge to work with Uber data because uh, we did a lot of work, uh, we grouped this data, mapped it with uh, other services data and uh, we tried different approaches how to work with this data. For example, uh, it's first of all, As uh, first of all, we are trying to make some predictions in real time, but uh, uh, we decided that it's not possible because uh, we have data uh, with, uh, at uh, two minutes ago, uh, two months ago, and it's like we are longer and predict something, uh, some event uh, uh, that will happen two months ago. And we decided so uh, it will be great uh, to. Uh, um, predict some data um, by some um, uh, correlations from past, for example. Um, I think, uh, um, and uh, I think uh, everyone knows uh, that uh, when we have Tuesday and second uh, EM, for example, or PM, and uh, if uh, the situation is good, uh, this data movement speed will be uh, pretty close to uh, the same data from uh, Tuesday's uh, second PM from uh, other months, uh, our other weeks, and, uh, and uh, 
we used uh, this correlation uh, to build uh, uh, our matrices uh, to build uh, our uh, rules in a graph. Guys, you have and one more extra time in a minute. Okay, and uh, let's start. Uh, here Thank you. you will be redirected to the list of outstanding places in Kyiv, and here you can select what you want to visit. Uh, for now we have uh, only pictures, some description and estimated time uh, which you should spend uh, is here, it's from TechnoVisor. And here you can select some places, uh, I wanted to select Ferrovania, it's my favorite park, uh, and for example Golden Gate. And here I will click explore it, and I will have some unexpected error. <laughs> because because we changed our Wi-Fi network and our server was hosted here and uh, some uh, foreign services is not working but uh, let's refresh and maybe uh, okay um, <laughs> just explain by words okay uh, the main idea is that uh, we have uh, select uh, some places and uh, our system will uh, create uh, some road uh, between these places uh, by our criteria, uh, that, uh, by our algorithm that based on Uber speed data uh, for us uh, some data uh, about distances uh, from open uh, uh, open street map. So it's the fastest way to see all the points, yeah? Uh, yes, uh, it's uh, the fastest way uh, in the perfect situation uh, but um, uh, yes, it works so well um, uh, in the data that we extracted from a uh, Google Movement Speed. And okay, uh, over, okay. over Movement. Time is solid, okay. guys. Uh, um, we just Sorry, wanted sorry. to show you some pretty stuff, but uh, okay, uh, we have some parts that not awaited uh, from Google services, and we can show. Uh, how uh, they work. We can create new uh, road. Uh, let's add some places. And and after that, uh, we will have uh, some a uh, list of places. Uh, it's uh, a list uh, that created by uh, some primitive algorithms. But uh, after some uh, about thirty seconds. Uh, we will, uh, after some uh, about 30 seconds, we will get a uh, more optimized data because uh, these uh, calculations do take some time, and it's not okay to delay user. We are just showing for him some list of points, and after that, uh, we uh, showing him uh, uh, the more optimized uh, road that we can create. And also, uh, we can check in these places that it visited. And yes, also, it's clear, we understand. Yes, we understand yes, ideas. yes, and also uh, one more feature. Um, we, we, uh, yes, we thought about uh, monetization of our application, so um, it, we decided to uh, uh, inject some uh, other services. For example, we can just uh, okay. create some question. If you have a question, yes. somebody interested in So, do we have any questions? Or about the monetization. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think it's better to arrange some meeting in future because uh, 30 hours is not enough to make some good service and uh, we need uh, to buy some hosting because hosting in this Wi Fi is open. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Segments uh, and uh, <coughs> we have uh, this list of relations for every uh, uh, day of week, every hour. Uh, it's uh, uh, some uh, general generalized data from uh, past, uh, but it's close uh, to uh, current data if uh, some uh, extra accidents will not happen. For example, uh, uh, some crashes uh, or other bad stuff. But, um, uh, pretty close. Uh, I 
think uh, it's better uh, than not uh, um, use. It's better to uh, miss some moments that uh, not use this data. In the most cases, it will be the yeah, best. Yeah, in the most cases, yes. But uh, in the future, uh, we have some idea to uh, inject some uh, lifetime data. That, but uh, we are thinking about uh, where we can get it, and we will uh, very bound it in time. Okay. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. Do we have any other questions? No.